Welcome back to Senior Spotlight. I'm your host, Brielle Jungla, and today we have the pleasure of meeting with Johnson Holiday from the men's golf team. Johnson, thank you for joining us. How are you doing today? I'm doing good. So tell us how you feel about being a senior, finally. Uh, it's, it's a relief. Um, <laughs> finally I finally made it. Yeah, finally <laughs> made it. But, uh, you know, it's been a lot of fun, so I can't, I, mean, I can't complain. Awesome. So tell us, a little, <clears throat> tell us a little bit about yourself. Uh... I'm just uh, born and raised in Gallants Ferry, South Carolina. Mm -hmm. um, went to school at Ainer High School. Uh, uh, Ainer High School. Okay. And how far away is that? Uh, it's probably like three hours away. Okay, so you're not too far from home. Yeah, it's not you too far. You go home whenever you want to. Yeah. I'm sure your parents enjoy yeah, that. Yeah, my mom loves it. <laughs> <laughs> so tell us what your major is. Uh, business management. Okay, and why did you choose business management? Um, because uh, my dad has a family-owned business that oh. hopefully one day I'll take over. Okay, and what kind well, of business is it? We can promote it a little bit. <laughs> um, it's a little bit of everything. I don't okay. know. I can't really get into the deets. Okay. <laughs> so um, tell us how you um, managed to find your way here at USC again. Um, well, at first, I mean, I, I was looking at a lot of different schools for golf. My, my main focus was you know, finding a school mm -hmm. that I could play golf at and, you know, make it to the next level. Right. And uh, playing all these tournaments, Car Carlisle contacted me, and he was one of the first few coaches to contact me. Okay. And, uh, you know, from that moment, he said, you know, I know it's early on in the, like, the recruiting process or your deciding process. And he said, you know, I'll give you as much time as you needed. And that really kind of, you know, hit hard because right. I was like, you know, this guy wants me to go here, but he's, you know, he's allowing me to spread out and kind of figure out where yeah. I want to go. So that was a good impression. <clears throat> yeah, and it kind of it kind of stuck with me the whole time. That's awesome. Yeah. Um. So tell us, did you play any other sports growing up? Uh. Or was just golf pretty much. I did. I uh, I, I ran cross country in high mm -hmm. school. I actually made it on the basketball team, <laughs> and then decided that I didn't need to play. It just wasn't for you. Yeah, I was like, well, you know, if I really want to become like uh, or go to school for golf, right. I need to you know and focus in on it. What got you into golf? Um, my family plays. Everyone, everyone in my family plays. Uh, you know, competitiveness and all that. I used to play. I used to play baseball right. at um, at First Baptist in Charleston, hmm. and and actually in the rec leagues as well. And there was like a coach that put his son over pitcher, like over like put him in before me, oh. and he actually like got me on the team. He's like, I'm not having you pitch against our team, <laughs> and so it kind of ruined me with baseball. And so like that kind of all led me to playing. Well, playing here you golf. are now, so it kind of worked <laughs> out in your favor. Yeah. <clears throat> so, is there any one particular person that you are like super thankful for that's helped you along this journey? <clears throat> oh wow, there's there's been a lot. I mean, whether it's like with school or with anything, with with my sport, you know, I have uh, my buddy Brandon, you know, I got here and he came as a, I don't know, maybe a sophomore or something mm -hmm. like that. I'm not really sure, but uh, he's been one of my best buds like throughout the years and he's helped me with my golf game. And I mean, there's many, many people that I've met on the journey. That, right, so you can't just pick one. Yeah, I can't really pick one, but for golf, I would say, say Brandon. Okay. Yeah. So if you could pick like one memory that's just your absolute favorite here, which one are you gonna choose? Oh man, um, this one kind of gets people. Yeah, I, I don't know. I, for golf, you know, I really liked winning the conference last year. Right. It, was, it was really pretty cool. Um, that was pretty exciting. Um, <laughs> also, uh, I mean, making it the the final uh, elite eight and making it to match play in the national championship. My my first year playing was amazing. Pretty, yeah, pretty amazing. <laughs> Unheard yeah. of, almost. Yeah. Freshman dream of that. Yeah. That's so cool. Um, so, how do you want to be remembered here at USC again? Wow. Um, I don't know. I really don't know. I, I never really have thought about that. Um, I don't know. That's a nice guy. Fun. Fun to hang out with. I think you've done a Sweet. good job. Sweet. I think you've done a good job. Every time I see you, you have a smile on your face, so that's always good. So if you could describe your time here in just one word, what word would you use? Uh, I'll say amazing. That's a good one. Cliche. Yeah. Okay, last question. Do you have any big plans for after graduation? Um, one I say one of the biggest plans is probably turning professional, mm -hmm. giving it, giving it a shot. Um, and how does that process work? Oh, well, for me, I'm gonna take it a little bit um, easier route. For uh, I'm gonna stay amateur until um, like um, 
web.com qualifier. Mm -hmm. I'm actually going to stay amateur through that process, but if I make it, I'll just turn professional. If I don't, then I can just still play amateur events. So it's a little bit, a little bit nicer because I can keep on playing. Okay, so that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna play golf. Yeah. that's awesome. Well, we wish you the best of luck. Yeah, thank well, you. Well, thank you so much for joining us. We've had a pleasure of watching you over these past couple of years. Like I said, we wish you nothing but the best of luck. Okay. All right, everyone, that wraps things up with Johnson Senior Spotlight. Make sure you tune in next time. Yeah.